education system beneficial for Indian students and workers? Travelling of skillful workforce from India to United Kingdom increased at the sharpest speed in the year 2018. Addressing to India Dominic Esquith, the British High Commissioner has mentioned that students and workers from India involving the low-skilled workers will get advantage from the latest immigration system to be executed by the United Kingdom after Brexit. While speaking at the press conference, Esquith stated that the alterations being schemed in the immigration policy will be virtuous for international students who will have a lengthier period after their studies come to an end to search for a job in the United Kingdom. It will also be suitable for individuals with lesser skill level and it would grade in less rules and regulations for those employers who hire non-EU workforce. The United Kingdom is concluding the immigration white paper which will outline the upcoming migration structure after Brexit this year. Furthermore, the High Commissioner stated that in the year 2018, more than 20,000 students from India obtained study visas, which was approximately 80% upsurge over visas allotted two years in the past. The relocation of skillful workforce from India to the United Kingdom upsurged at the quickest level in the year 2018, and over 60,000 skilled work visas were allotted to Indian citizens. The visas for Indian skillful employees were more than all other nations merged. The High Commissioner invited cricket supporters keen to watch the World Cup in the United Kingdom between May and July to accelerate their visa applications. We are looking forward to over 70,000 Indian visitors for the World Cup and we want them to understand that it takes nearly 15 working days for visa applications to be administered and they must apply on time, as stated. He further informed that in the year 2018, 9 out of 10 visa applications were approved and 95% were handled within 15 working days. The amount of tourist visas from India increased by 10% in the year 2018 to just under 500,000. Answering to queries regarding how quickly India and United Kingdom may start discussions on a free trade agreement FTA, the High Commissioner stated that while the two nations may not debate fairs since the United Kingdom continued to be a part of the European Union, discussions on matters such as market access and governing regulators were permitted and were by this time functioning. Obviously, we cannot settle an FTA with India till we have finalized the Brexit process and it is still not well defined what will it seem like. But my panel and ministers have been participating in useful discussions with the correspondents in the Indian Commerce Ministry. We hope you like this video. Please comment below if you want to know more. Thanks for watching.